Hey guys, so we're gonna go ahead and get started here with some primer and and just smother that all over my face. <laughs> this is one of my favorite primers right now and it's really illuminating so we're just gonna put that all over. So we're moving on and we're gonna do some foundation and just get that again all over the face, nice and stippled in um, all over my skin just to make sure everything's evened out because I do have redness in my cheeks and I like to go ahead and blend all that out. So. We're gonna be loading this on and then using it around top kabuki from Sigma and just buffing that out. I feel my whole life is about blending. <laughs> it's like, oh, that's all I do is just blend, 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 blend. So we're just gonna load that on. And moving on to brows, we're gonna use the Makeup Revolution Brow Palette that they just put out. I love this palette. It's got everything you need all in one handy to go, easy travel kit, and it's awesome. Um, the colors are great. I feel like it is good for every skin tone and you can build up the color if you do have darker brows and if you do have lighter brows, you can kind of blend those out. So it's good for everyone. So we're gonna go ahead and put some gel on these brows so that I can get these wily hairs taken care of and once we're done with that we're gonna be moving on with some eye primer and you don't really need eye primer for this look because we're really just doing a very bare eye but I like it just because I feel like it has more staying power so any eyelid primer will do we're just gonna get it on there and move on So I'm going to do the Magic Lumi Highlighter. I really love this stuff. I actually just got it and I feel like it does give me a, a really luminous look right in my T-zone and down my nose, like the bridge of my nose, my um, Cupid's bow, which is not very pronounced to begin with, and my chin. And I don't feel like I look greasy by the end of the day, which some of the highlighters do look kind of greasy. So I'm just still trying this stuff out we'll see how it goes anyways okay so now we're just setting everything with a um, loose powder and making sure that that's you know covering everything so that your makeup doesn't break up throughout the day so just gonna do that real quick and move on to the eyes and this is a color that I use from cosmetics I don't know the name offhand but I'll put it in the description bar for you guys so that you guys know what it is it's kind of like a mauve light pink color I love it just because it does give me a great transition from the real dark color to a lighter color um, so that's why I use it now I'm taking makeup geek and again I don't know the color offhand I believe it's latte and I'm gonna just kind of darken that crease but again, I'll put it in the description bar so you guys have it. And now I'm gonna go through with my NYX. Um, I guess this is the Runway Collection. I don't even know if they have this anymore, but any champagne with some glitter will do. It doesn't really matter where it's from because this is a very light eye look. We're really gonna focus more on the lips, so it doesn't really matter. You can use whatever you have in your collection. If you've got, and naked palette if you've got some sort of you know nude palette from Maybelline or whatever it do what you want <laughs> and it all looks the same so now I'm gonna go through and just kind of buff that out all I'm really working on is trying to make sure that all of the harsh lines are blended that is the biggest thing about this look you just want it to be really really smoked out um, and really light so you don't need a whole lot of product um, now what I'm doing is just my eyeliner, which sucks. I hate eyeliner because it takes me forever, but it looks so good once it's all done, obviously. Um, okay, so I lost a lot of footage here and I feel really bad because I didn't re like reshoot it, but um, I put on my lashes and mascara and I totally lost the footage, guys. Sorry, but this is what it looks like. Now I'm just kind of contouring my face with the... Uh, Kat Von D palette and that palette is awesome. Um, I'm starting to really love it and Not use my chocolate so lay bronzer as much and so you'll be seeing a lot more of the palette in my upcoming tutorials <laughs> Then I'm using um, Some blush from sleek makeup. It's called 
rose gold, I believe, and it looks like a dupe of the orgasm. So I just place that on the cheeks. Then I'm doing highlighter with the hourglass. And now we're doing the lips. And this is a mahogany or burgundy color from NYC. And I'll, again, put everything in the bar below. So we're just putting that on and we're gonna clean up in detail too with a smudger brush and a little bit of concealer just so there's no bleeding. And from there, we are all set. I hope you guys like this video. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys for leaving um, comments and liking my videos. You guys keep me going, making me wanna do more and more. If you wanna see something specific, please let me know. Other than that, we'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much again, guys, uh, for all the love. See ya.